Hey everyone, what's up? How's it going? I'm Mariah and today we're going to be painting this set of two 10 by 20 inch canvases. So let's get into it. So for this set today, I want to use orange, teal, this seafoam turquoisey green, and then I've got this metallic pearl marmalade. Um, I don't know, I just really like these colors together, teal, orange. It reminds me of like Arizona and kind of being out west, the red rock. I just think they look really beautiful together. Hopefully that will translate onto the canvas. We'll see. Today's kind of an experiment. I'm always experimenting with new color combinations and different types of pores. Yeah, I'm excited to just kind of let my creativity flow today and see where this painting takes us. For this painting, I'm going to do a black base. And I used a lot of paint, but this is this is quite a large surface area. It's basically like doing a 20 by 20 inch. So a lot of paint. So I wanted to have a good, you know, solid base down. I guess I'll kind of move it around a little bit. I lost one of my little stands. These are actually um, little condiment reusable Tupperware things. Got them from got them from the dollar store. I actually, I think originally bought them to make jello shots, <laughs> but now they are good for my paintings, drying, um, varnish. I have them all over the place. So I was actually really glad that I have a lot of them. <laughs> okay, so I think I wanna see black and this dark turquoise together. And we're gonna layer them like a ring pour. I don't think I'm gonna end up doing a ring pour. I'll probably just end up pouring it wherever I want, but um, I'm gonna layer them. I always have it hit the wall first. All right, so blue, take all the caps off. So we've got the dark turquoise. Now I'm gonna use the lighter kind of seafoam turquoise. Now I'm gonna do orange. And then last, I'm gonna do this, the pearl marmalade color. don't want to mix more right now so we'll have to see how far this this can take us now whenever I do these ring pour layering you know stuff I'm not super careful when layering and usually they kind of bleed into each other which I'm sure that's something's happening there but usually it kind of creates like a blended nice sometimes it can be good not always but All right, this is the last one. Turquoise, sea foam, orange, and marmalade. All right, now how do I want the design? As I usually do, I think I'm just gonna start pouring and kind of see what looks good and I'll continue to do that. Get my hair out of the way. Of course, I stained this sweatshirt already. I know it would get paint on it. I, I knew going in, but immediately dipped my hair in and got it on my sweatshirt. I usually don't wear my hair down when I'm painting, but I've been wearing my hair up a lot lately and I just want to give it a break and let it stay down, but I really don't want to get paint in it. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm nervous. This is a little bit of a risky kind of color combination. It looks very interesting in there, so I'm just kind of scared, but um, fingers crossed. It's all in the spirit of experimentation, right? So let's, uh, let's try it. Hmm, okay. It's 
getting a little bit muddy. Mmm, I love that. All right. Interesting. Kind of looks like snakes. Like that reminds me of a snake. It looks a little bit muddy, but we'll see. Let's torch it and tilt it out and see how it goes. The flame on my torch is getting very low. I gotta refill the butane seeing a little bit of bubbles pop, so I know it's working. All right, that's about as much as I can get. I'm scared. <laughs> All right, I think I might need more paint. Yes, always good to add more just in case. All right. Okay. I keep delaying. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm going to do this one first. I'm being very slow and deliberate with the way that I'm tilting the canvas. Try to keep as much control as possible. Um, oops, while understanding that, okay, sometimes we can get into dangerous territory. I don't want to spill over onto that one. <clears throat> Um, while understanding, I think I was saying that um, you can't always control it. You try and you do the best you can, but. <clears throat> I do like it, it's pretty, pretty cool. It's definitely kind of out there, a little bit different, but I like different, I like weird. I like these colors, obviously I picked them for a reason. And I do think it looks pretty sweet. Trust the process. It's like a cool geode type of thing. Good for now. Of course. Wow, that looks cool. I was so in it that I was kind of like focused and not really looking, but like, I think I like it. That neon orange really does pop because the others, like the um, sea foam with the marmalade, I don't know. I think, I guess that's gonna shine and be nice and metallic, but some of it kind of mixed together and made some weird colors, but the orange and the turquoise both kind of stayed strong in some spots and really pop. So, wow, interesting. I'm happy, uh, happy with the, how that looks. This one, we will see. I'm excited to spread that out. So, I'm gonna come down this way towards me first. <laughs> oh boy, scary stuff. Wow, okay, spreading very nicely. I'm excited. Look at that gorgeous, like, oh, the cells. Please dry nicely, please. Bug, little fly. Please dry the way that I'm praying you guys will. I'm glad I added more paint, which I usually am glad when I add more paint. Because I got to remember, these are big. These are big. Ooh, 
Don't want to lose too much over the edge. But I do want to get the corners, not at the expense of anything gorgeous. Wow. All right, I completely zoned out. What? Okay, hopefully you guys aren't looking at this like, girl, you crazy, why are you so excited? But like, I think it looks amazing. Let me pick my jaw up <laughs> off the floor. I'm pleasantly surprised. You guys know I was stalling, t pouring it out, tilting it. Um, I was nervous, but oh my God, I am really, happy with this okay I'm not quite done I need to get these edges should I just do black okay I need to be careful I think it was right here it's fine but I need to be careful <laughs> all right give me a second I'm gonna touch up these edges and I'll see you in a couple minutes Wow, I really love the way that this set came out. I'm blown away by the way that the colors work together. I was kind of praying that they would look good together and I just, I'm really excited. I hope it dries as good as it looks. I love the cells. I love the color interaction. I hope you guys like it too. At the end of the video, I'll insert a photo and or a video clip of these dry. And thank you so much for watching. Your support means so much to me and I really appreciate it. So please like, please comment, let me know what you think. Let me know what color combinations you would like to see in the future. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to tune in for my next video. I upload every Sunday evening. Thank you. Bye.